Hey guys, Ioki here. In today's video, I'm going to be talking about some of the greatest free learning resources for League of Legends. These are going to be websites, resources, tools, and services that are available to you at no cost if you're looking to actually take the time, invest in your own skill, delete your ego, and actually improve in areas of the game, like game knowledge, mechanics, everything. So what this video is not going to be is it's not going to be a clickbaity how to get challenger in five minutes like I'm sure you guys have seen all over YouTube. I want this video to actually serve as a catalog to resources in which you can better yourself if you put in the time. So this video is going to direct or suggest a few of the best learning resources that I use for League of Legends. And before we get started, I wanted to make it very clear this is not a sponsored video. I have no monetary investment in encouraging you guys to check out these resources. I just wanted to get that out there that this isn't a case of, you know, where I'm telling you to check out skillcap.com and use this specific code to sign up and get a free trial or whatever. It, it's nothing like that. So first off on this list is the Summoner School subreddit. So this is the second most popular League of Legends related subreddit behind, of course, our League of Legends. Uh, now the difference between the two though is on the front page of our League of Legends you're going to be finding all kinds of you know, clickbaity material, funny memes, champion teasers, whiny posts about how X champion needs to get buffed or nerfed. I mean, you guys know what it's like sometimes. It, it's it can be a really entertaining subreddit, and sometimes it's just, bleh. like I mean, I mean, it makes sense when something gets as big as League of Legends. Not all of the content produced about it is going to be relevant to you or of a good quality. Summoner School is a beginner's League of Legends subreddit. It's all about providing relevant learning materials tips and tricks, lower elo players asking for advice, it's all about bettering yourself. It's a subreddit that exists for people that look at League of Legends and say, wow, this is actually you know, a deep and rich game and I would like to know more about it and get better at it. So if you go to the subreddit with this mentality, you're going to fit in. And there's also a 9 to 1 self-promotion rule, so it's not just filled with people looking to promote themselves or their channels, because in order for them to post one thing about themselves, they need to leave nine other helpful comments on other people's materials. It's a really great subreddit, and I've always adored it, and I try my hardest to be active on that board because I really think it's something special. Next up on this list is, of course, watching replays of your own games. I know it's not the most exciting, but seriously, I can't stress this enough that watching your own game, watching your games after the fact and being level-headed about it and not really having any stake in it since the game is already over, it allows you to be far more objective about the mistakes you're making as a player. Watching replays used to be kind of a clusterfuck since a lot of shadier sites offered replays, but you know, you had to download their client or you had to sign up for free trials and all that schwarbage. But not anymore, there's a lot of popular replay sites that are ver very well known and trustworthy. Things like LOL Replays, uh, Replay.gg, which actually records all of your games for two weeks. You just have to change one of your room pages to a certain name so they know that you're not a bot. And I'll leave links to all of these replay sites that I use in the description of this video. I primarily use Replay.gg. It's very fast and efficient and one of the more popular replay sites. And I also think that getting coaching from a higher ELO player is a fantastic way to grow in a very small amount of time, you know, getting another pair of eyes on your gameplay. But that's a video for another day because most coaching services uh, are not free, and this video is meant to focus on all of the free resources you have at your disposal. So we're going to move on to the list, and last but not least is Law King. So there are lots of guides and aggregate guide sites out there that are similar to Law King, you know, sites like Mobifier, and many of them, you know, have overtly confusing layouts, not the greatest search engines. You're going to get guides that aren't filtered necessarily by quality, but by popularity. Uh, Law King has done a great job by offering a free guide writing portion of their site implemented right into it. So anyone can write a guide. So you have popular players like Tobias Fate, for instance, can write these huge, long, in-detail guides if you want to learn about, you know, Gangplank or whoever he's playing. People that have invested hundreds or thousands of hours into a certain champ can really break it down in these big, long sections. And it, of course, has the individual player lookup function, but the builds and the long guides, you can really just sit down and read them for hours and mull over the theory crafting and passion that went into them. So that's going to wrap up this video's list of the best free learning resources for League of Legends. If you guys enjoyed this video, like and subscribe. I'm putting a huge amount of time, energy, and passion into my YouTube lately. If you guys have any learning resources that you use regularly that I didn't list here, list them down below in the comments. I would love to hear them. Other than that, I hope to see you guys at the stream. Take it easy, and good luck on your guys' journey to improvement. Peace.